What's up guys, I'm Gunner Majoni, and today we're going to be opening a 12,000 point pack in Madden 18's Ultimate Team Mode. Now before you can open packs, you either need to have enough coins for the corresponding packs, or enough points, which of course are purchased with real money. Now if you're planning on buying a lot of packs, I highly recommend on getting EA Access if you don't already have it. It costs $5 a month, so by default it's going to save me $5 off this 12,000 points, and effectively pay itself off. Every 12,000 points I get after that, it will save me about $10. So if you're planning on getting a lot of packs, this is the way to go. So the pack that I'm going to be opening today is the 12,000 point gold premium mega bundle. At a minimum, it comes with three elite cards, 72 gold cards, and 141 silver cards. Now the key here is three elite and 72 gold cards, because that is the minimum that you're going to get. Hopefully I'll get more than that. Now generally speaking, silver cards go for around 500 coins, and golds go from anywhere between 1,000 coins and 5,000 coins, depending on the stats and the team that they play for. For example, the Dallas Cowboys are a very popular team, as much as I hate them. So therefore, their cards sell for much more aggressively in the auction house than, say, less popular teams. Elite cards go from anywhere from 6,000 coins and up, generally speaking, um, and elite cards are where the best and most expensive cards in the game are. Alright, so let's go ahead and buy this uh, 12,000 point pack. So what you're going to be getting here is 33 gold premium packs and 3 elite player packs. So we're going to start out with the elite player packs. Alright, ooh, shit. So off the back we got an 84 Willie McGinnis, which is actually good because I've been looking for him for a while. Silver, 81 Ross Cockrell, all right, he'll go for a good bit. Gold, gold, and a silver. All right, so that's actually a pretty good uh, start to this pack set. So let's move on to the next one. All right, got a silver, 84 Vernon Hargreaves, that's good because this is team of the week pick. Uh, these guys tend to go for a lot on the open market right now, so probably be able to sell him for a good twenty-five or 30,000 coins. Alright, right tackle Jeremy Parnell. Another gold. And a silver. Alright, that was another good pack. Alright, so we got one more of these elite player packs. Let's see how it goes. All right, silver, silver, got a gold. All right, Hunter Henry, not worth too much, if I remember correctly. I think he's around the 6,000 or 7,000 coins, but better than nothing. And Darren McFadden to round him out for golds. All right, so that's going to round out the elite player packs. So now we're going to be going on to the uh, gold player packs. All right, so we got gold, silver, gold, silver, silver, and gold. All right, so not all that great of a pack. Let's go on to the next one. Silver, gold, gold, silver, gold, and silver. Man, hopefully we start getting some uh, elites popping up in these packs. All right, let's try the next. All right, so our next pack, we got a silver, gold, another silver, TJ Watt. All right, that's a good gold pickup. And round it out with Alvin Kamara. All right, good. He'll sell for a good little bit. All right, going on to the next one. Got a silver. Oh, elite. Ah, just Tory Smith. He's probably worth about six thousand. But we got our first elite in the gold pack, so that works out. All right, got the gold and a silver. So that one outside of getting Tory Smith, not so good of a pack. All right, we got a silver. Jake Matthews gold. All right. All right. Another silver, 
silver and silver. Hmm. Well, at least we got Jake Matthews out of that one. I know he'll sell for probably about thirty-five hundred to four thousand coins. All right, on to the next one. All right, Case Keenum doesn't even play for the Rams anymore. All right, Joe Thomas. And Cody Kessler. All right, that's a solid gold pickup. All right, on to the next. Come on, come on, let's get some elites. Silver, gold. Gold, silver. Miles Jack, all right, that's a solid gold pickup right there. He's a borderline elite. And another silver, all right. So Miles Jack is going to be a good seller in this one. And then Kamar Aiken, he's a relatively quick receiver, so he should sell pretty easy too. All right, next we got Chase Daniel for a gold. Silver, silver, silver. All right. Dakota Dazier, something like that. All right. And another silver to round it out. Hopefully we start getting a couple more elites popping in here because, you know, golds are nice, but that's a little tedious selling all those guys. All right, got silvers so far. Ooh, there's a lot of silvers. All right, Lorenzo, however the hell you say your last name. And an elite. All right, well, Devontae Parker, I'll be able to get a solid 8,000 for him. But at least we got another elite out of this pack. Let's carry on this good luck going into the next one. All right, we got a silver. All right, Sterling Shepard. He's a good fast receiver. He'll be able to sell pretty easy. Craig Robinson, good linebacker. All right, and rounded out with silvers. Man, we're really not having good luck with all these silvers coming in. All right, silver, silver. All right, Ladarius Gunter. All right, it's a good gold pickup. Arthur Brown, good gold. There we go, Rodney McLeod, 79 with the Eagles. That's a good pickup right there. He'll probably be one of my backup safeties. All right, next, Matt Castle. I actually sold a Matt Castle earlier today for 4,500 coins. All right, Christian Ringo. All right, Cyrus Jones. This is a good pack so far. Oh, I jinxed myself. All right, Jerron Brown. Oh, man, I got scared for a second. I saw those two silvers in a row. All right, let's see what we got next. All right, so Kerry Hyder. Silver. Oh, Elite. Uh, Carl Joseph. Well, that's still one of the better ones we've gotten so far. I actually have one of him already. Uh, but I want to say he goes for about 8,500 coins. Jonathan Casales, silver, and a silver. All right, so obviously the big pickup out of this one's Carl Joseph. Next up, all right, Dontrell Inman. I know I'll be able to sell him for a good 5,000 coins. Buda Baker. All right, all right. All right. Not too great of a pack, but the Dontrell and Min rounded it out pretty nice. All right, so we got Tavares King, Silver, Brandon LaFell. All right, that's a good gold pickup. David Ninjuku, which I think it is a crime that that guy is rated as low as he is in this game. I understand he's a rookie, but he should be rated a lot higher. All right, let's go to the next one. All right, got Sam Young. All right, Brian Poole, be able to sell him for a good little bit. All right, come on, let's get some elites. Let's get some elites. No luck, stick them with silvers. All right, let's roll on to the next pack here. All right, we got silver. Giovanni Bernard, okay. Be able to sell him for probably 6,000-ish coins. All right, Carl Bradford. 
Oh. Oh, all right. Tyrell Williams. Okay, probably be able to sell him for about 8000 Man, that's pretty nice, though. We got two elites and one gold pack here. Granted, they're not big elites, but hey, elites are elites. All right, we got silver. All right, Terrell McLean. Okay. Ooh, we got a baby goat. We'll cover those in a second. Uh, oh, okay. Well, hello, Dinata. Okay. Solid elite defensive tackle. Probably be able to sell him for about 6000 or so. But the big pickup out of this pack are these baby goats. Now, they're pretty rare to get in normal packs, but baby goats, generally speaking, go for about 8,000 coins apiece, even though they're only rated at 73. So keep that in mind. You get baby goats and you don't want to actually keep them, about 8,000 coins apiece. All right, so we got Jordan Poyer, Jakey Smith, all right, silver, silver, and a silver. Not a very good run through there. What do we got? What do we got? All right, Benjamin Watson, solid tight end. All right, another Ladarius Gunter. All right, eh. Decent pack. All right, Tim Barnes. There we go, and Andreas Pete. All right, with the Saints, should be able to sell him pretty easy, probably about forty five hundred. All right, Andre Holmes. All right, Watson, silver, and a silver. I think it's crazy that Ryan Switzer is only rated a 65. That guy's a beast. He's going to prove a lot of people wrong, even though he plays for the Cowboys, and I do hate the Cowboys. But that dude's a beast. All right, silver, silver, silver. All right, Nick, however the hell you say your last name. I'm in the same boat with you, bud. No one can pronounce mine either. And Matt Slauson, all right. Eh, decent pickup. Now, I haven't looked at Nick here in a while, but I remember like maybe like a week and a half ago, he was going for about 5,000 coins. So hopefully that's still the case with him. All right, on to the next one here. Silver, silver, silver. Golly, how many silvers are we going to get? Oh, okay, there we go. 83 Carlos Dunlap. Man, that guy, that guy is a freaking monster. He tore me apart in one of the games I played in earlier today. Guy was driving me crazy. Man, that's the big pickup right there out of this one. That makes me happy. Next up, Terrence West. All right, decent backup running back. Another Carl Bradford. Guy's got some great hair, I tell you what. Silver, silver. And another Tim Barnes. Man, these guys are popular today, huh? All right, next, Silver. All right, Mercedes Lewis. Good backup tight end. All right, Frank Clark, 81. Eh, pretty decent. Probably be able to get about 7,500 to 8,000 for him on the market. And Nick Williams. All right, cool. Next up, we got Denora Searcy. All right. Oh, we got an elite. Uh, Rob Havesine. Okay. Probably be able to get about mm, 65 to 7,500 for him. Man, I tell you what, we haven't really had a big elite pull yet. Hopefully, we're going to get something big. Got my fingers crossed. All right. Jimmy Garoppolo. Man. A lot of silvers in this one. Karen Williams. Hopefully I said that right. Man, a lot of silvers there. That one, really, the only person at any uh, price there would have been Garoppolo. All right, Sims. Silver, silver, silver. All right, Crawford. I know he'll sell. Preston Smith. All right. I just got to say, this guy, that is a very red-haired man. Let's move on to the next. 
All right, so Isaiah Crowell, that is a fantastic backup running back pickup right there. All right, Cleary, Silver, Joe Holy, and Marcus Martin. Really? Marcus Martin's only a 66? Wow, I thought he would have been higher. All right, on to the next. All right, Devon House, getting a bit old. Silver, silver, silver. All right, Ricky Jean Francois. I didn't realize he played for Green Bay now. Okay, there we go. Malik Jackson, 83. That's going to be a good little pickup. I'm going to have to look him up after this video and see how much he's worth. But if I had to guess, I'd probably say about 12,000 coins, if not a little more. All right, next up, silver, silver. Silver. Man, a lot of silvers. Okay. Ashawn Robinson. I think it's Ashawn. So I remember seeing him come through one of my packs, a, I think, a week ago, and I sold him for about 4,000 coins. So he should be a good little pickup. Michael Ower. Yeah, that rating's probably about right. All right. Marcus Robinson. I'm surprised. I thought Marcus Robinson would have been a gold. It's a little weird. All right. We got a silver, silver. Cooper Cup, all right. I like that dude. That guy is going to be a solid receiver for the Rams. I hear he's going to be a starter this year. Sims, yeah, even as a rookie, I hear he's going to be a starter. Kellen Clemens, all right. Josh Robinson, if I remember correctly, that's a dude off Hard Knocks. Hmm. I think he like hurt his knee or something. All right, Michael Johnson. Really, Michael Johnson's a seventy-four. That's crazy. I would have thought he would have been an elite. All right. Pace Murphy. I don't even know who that guy is. I'll be honest. And Rhett Ellison. All right. Fullback. Man, that's really crazy. I can't believe that guy's a 74. That dude's a beast. All right. So that's it for our gold premium packs. Uh, that was all 33. So... Um, all right, so the final tally is 115 silvers, 83 golds, and a whopping 15 elites. I'll be honest, I didn't think that we got 15 as we went through. It seemed like they were a bit more sporadic than that. But unfortunately, we didn't get that big high roller, like 86, 87, 89, something like that like number. But we got a couple solid elites in there, and we got enough golds in here to where we should be able to get a good little bit. So, yeah. Hopefully.